Alrighty. So, uh, you are writing that you worked on the body, hands, and face for the last shot. All right. Let's check it out. Just some context. Some context here. Checking all this out. The flow. The feel. All very cool. Bit softer on that tip down. Cool. Hold on, let me just. Okay. I think it would be cool doing whoops, doing uh, this last section here. Just since we're only seeing the hips, just make sure that as you put all the weight on this leg here, you got some just technical things where your leg kind of pops into place here. You do want to feel how this side of the hips go up just for the weight shift, and you can re, you know, you can do a shift over there, and then might a little bit of a, I mean, he does slide the leg over, but maybe you can just slide over, and then it's you know a little bit of a tiny slide back this way just so you can kind of reposition the hips into a straighter fashion just something so we can kind of tell there's a little bit of a back and forth again subtle it just feels very clean how it comes over stops and then goes straight down again it's all very clean in one axis and it's really very, ooh, like a very very clean ease in and i think it would be neat to get a bit of a over there a slight weight shift back and then on the way down you know, I could favor one side, whatever you want to choose, but probably I would probably say this side coming towards us and maybe, you know, with a bit of a bit of a I'm exaggerating, obviously, with a bit of a, a lean, like a little twist. Um, what's the word? Side lean in the body, just so it's not so super clean. So you might land on one butt cheek first and, it's you know, it's a bit leaning over this way. And then as he lands onto that thing, he, go, he straightens up a bit, but it's also a bit of a harder boom hard to plop onto that wooden bench and then potentially it could also be a bit of slight little pause almost before it sits down and then plops down just so to get some contrast and some texture in the timing it just feels a bit even that's all cool I like what his eyes are doing there it's cool Uh, keep working on these guys. There was some contact points missing, you know, intersections and stuff like that. It's just mainly to me the the evenness in terms of posing. How it comes down, how smoothly it just eases in and stops. It doesn't feel like it's butt cheeks and bones and everything plopping onto a wooden bench. But that's all cool. There's something here in the face. Hold on. I wonder if this is too big. It's almost like he heard something and, and it's also kind of looking at me. Um, so I would probably just go maybe this between this and this or only this far. Just in terms of goes up, there's a bit of a dart to the side, just a bit less, right? Only till here ish between these two. And then back here, and that feels almost a bit too arky. And even what eyes are doing, which feels like a bit much. It just, it's, it gets a bit unclear what he's doing here. He goes up and like, to me, it felt like he goes up, huh? Suddenly so hears something and then goes over because he's checking maybe something over there. And then it's more of a, a thought process type of thing. So it feels like you want to like little pause there and goes up just a weird moment where he looks at me but it's, it could be if you take that time where he maybe he looks straight a bit longer it's a quick look over there and then less arky maybe a bit faster maybe just to check maybe he's looking left and right who else is here or if, if no one's here just a bit unclear what he's doing what the concern is at the same time to be honest, I don't even know if we need it because he comes in here, right? And he looks around, he looks around, he has all the 
sheepish look here. Same thing here. He looks around. He's seen everything. By now, you should know what's going on. I wonder. I'm just speaking out loud. Um, you know, thinking out loud here. And this could be completely stupid. But what if you go just from here. And you have that. All this here. All that good stuff. And instead of looking over. You go from this. Straight into. I want to say straight into this. It's basically just. Basically looking up. And doing all that thought process here. Into that. Without left. Without right. You know what I mean? That look to the left, that look to the right. I don't think that's needed because it's, it feels like a repetition to all of what's going on here. So I think this could just be looking up and imagine he's doing the amount of darting that you have here, all of this here, but just kind of more contained within that focus point. It's looking forward. So what I'm trying to say is, right, he's got all of this. Pause a little bit the way you have it here, looks up, and just straight forward. And in that orientation, you do all of that type of thinking. And then into that. I think that I would focus probably on that. I mean, again, it's just all very subjective. You could do whatever you want to. Um, that would just be my impression that it feels almost redundant. Like we don't need all that extra thing here. And I think at this point, it could just all be internal. He's just thinking for himself what he needs to do and get to that resolution. And when he gets to this, there could be a slight movement in here to a lean forward, maybe a tensing or a lowering of the shoulders, however you want to play it. But it just feels a, a bit empty there. Just looking at the hand, are they contacting with the mouth and going down? So it could go down and maybe shoulders go up, just kind of... Maybe your shoulders roll forward a bit as well. But yeah, that's kind of it. Um, I'm curious what you think. Uh, you might want to keep all this. And then I would definitely just fix that. He doesn't look at us. That only just goes this far. And then on that look, like I said, just a bit faster. Cut a couple frames out and do less of an arc. Just a bit more straightforward. Um, which would also work. I'm just proposing a potential alternate. Where he just looks straight up, like I said thought process of all of this in here without a distinct left and right look. I hope that makes sense. If not, let me know, email me, and I can write it out. Um, but that's about it. Thank you. All right. There's an email. You can sign up. You can start whenever you want. You can submit whenever you want. You get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right. Thank you.